Despite the arduous journey towards enlightenment, our two single self-employed heroes, Adam and Lori, have managed to set aside enough time to pick up some fresh meat. This looks good. Warda, croissants. Oh, no? Oh, thank you so much. Oh, this That's is so sweet. sweet. Oh, he just gave us the onions? I feel like these are magic onions. They are. They're going to help you get a husband, Lori. Is this your stand over here? Wow, well, we grow the tomatoes, broccoli, cauliflower, shoot off, pretty much everything. Pretty much everything? Wow. Is it, is like a, is it a hard job growing all this produce? But it, it is a hard uh, job. Did you, you want to come? Yeah. OK, I would love to. Oh, thank you. Mm. Oh my god, These they're are the best so tomatoes fresh. In the world. They're so good. Do you think I could adjust to the farm? It's a tough job. It is a tough Tell me how hard it is to work on the farm. Yeah. I mean, you're looking like you're in shape. Yeah, I get in shape just so you want. Do you want another tomato? Yeah, I'll have another tomato. Do you eat tomatoes here all day? Hey, Adam, do you want a tomato? Yeah, the share, please. <laughs> Have one too. Those are the best tomatoes we have. Mm. You know, I feel like I could get used to farm life. Try it. Lori thinks she has this one in the bag. Thank so what you. are you guys doing? We're throwing a party tomorrow night. Okay. Text me, I'll come. Okay. And if you can bring a big platter of tomatoes, we will serve it up. Amazing, you know thank what, you. you. know what I'll do? Well, I'll, I'll bring it. Okay. You just bring it to the place. Oh, okay. That? That's pretty nice. Imagining a whole new life married to a farmer with hot biceps, Lori plans to taunt Adam with her new romance. Adam decides it's time to get his game face ready.